What? It's yours! Let's push for questions over here. Like, let's interrogate this mother fluffer. Give me answers! Of course it helps, you freaking idiot. Stop being so gosh, negative. I was right about him changing out of the bear costume. I thought it wouldn't happen, but it did. Previously on Bowie. So last time, we failed the seven wild dates romance-based reality show. But nobody gives a crap about that. We did, though, have two successful dates. One very fun and silly with Joquin, our friend, and one with Akira, who was our first kiss. And dare I say, our first... Well, but enough of the shenanigans googles for now. Let's go and find the blue sad furry in need of our help. But hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of playing The Sims 4 Lovestruck. So yeah, today we're gonna be looking for a bear. You know, a furry. A sad little blue furry. We know exactly where they are. But before we go and take on that quest, I really want to get our needs full. So Bowie over here, I really want you to go to the toilet. And then after that, I want you to get in some rest. Because I don't know if we're actually gonna be able to find this ring for the ring bear so our money is not supposed to be on 500 i actually just added money before starting to check out some items our money was actually on 153 i think yeah that is much better hey i heard you became friends with akira um agnes that's interesting coming from you okay but thank you yeah he's a good person i suppose before we head out oh hey i heard there's a talent showcase okay you want to go and embarrass yourself you go ahead and do that all right but anyway before we head out i think it's a good idea to see if we can find any new people on cupid's corner not that we're gonna go on a date or anything i just want to see what's new or who's new at least anyway so let's go ahead and check out all right so let's refresh the matches all right we got parker we got Travis, Travis Scott, oh my gosh, he's from base game, basically. Uh, Leah, Grayson, Diana, Cameron, he is obviously, well, a lot of people know this face. Uh, Yolanda, okay, no one really knew, but I suppose we can add Travis to our contacts and, I don't know, get to know Grayson, maybe. We can just add this dude here and then we can add this dude here. Yeah, but we're not gonna be creating a date today. We're gonna go on a quest to help a bear in need. What time is it? PM? It's night already? Oh well, that's fine. We can fish in the dark. It's okay. So let's go to this place over here. Whoa. <laughs> Look at all the romantic interests over here, like this is actually insane. Well, it's only these four, but yeah. Well, I mean, we are getting to know random people and a lot of them at that. So it's gonna make sense that we have romantic interests with more than one sim at this stage. All right, so we're starting off this quest in a super tense mood, which is great. All right, so let's go ahead and find the bear. Okay, I don't think the bear will be here at night, but at least we can continue the fishing extra. Oh, hey, here you are okay all right so this is telling me you definitely threw your ring into this pond right let's give them a pity hug so you know why i think it must be this pond well the bear is located in this area second of all this pond is heart shaped third of all this is the only pond in this area over here what no 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 we're not gonna be doing any spicy things at any spicy festival no but anyway coming back to point two okay it's heart shaped which means this reminded our sad little bear friend over here of the love that he used to have so yeah it must be this pond so let's go fishing in hopes of finding your ring my poor friend oh my gosh look at this little statue that's adorable it's like a yin and yang but heart shaped. Oh, I feel so sorry for this bear. We will help you, I promise. It's gonna be my mission to find this ring in this episode. And if we don't, well, there are still a few more episodes to go. So no hurry, but I really want to find it. What did we find? A tetra, okay. No, this is probably the saddest thing ever. Is this bear actually home? Oh my gosh. All right, you know, sleeping with your eyes open. That's a little bit creepy, brother. But you know, you know, this is just the saddest freaking sight ever. This is the saddest thing I've ever seen in this whole sims game i swear except for the ghost horse in horse ranch like that bear is so sad hey wait can we fish with them no we can't let's get to know the bear a little bit more shall we maybe um where where is where is where, oh, there we go here he is let's uh ask about sadness again although we know the answer to that question we're we're just gonna try and make conversation be more than just acquaintances there's a 
cute though. I want to see what I want to see how this dude looks like underneath this costume. But I'm not gonna spoil that for some people. All right. Hey, wait, 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 wait. Okay, I'm sorry I woke you up. Um, is there anything else we can talk about? So it seems like you can actually not, you know, get romantic and do any other interaction except for asking them about their sadness and about their freaking bear costume so yeah okay we can just leave them be and we can definitely also not fish with them which is sad so yeah let's go fish while we still have energy yeah we got energy enough to fishy fishy wish uh yeah i i can be adventurous sure now by the time she catches you know a box that looks like a chest that that might be either a totally random object, you know, like a cow plant berry or whatever else you can capture item-wise from any pond. But that little box might contain the ring that our bear is looking for. No thank to playing to I don't want you to dislike fishing because we really want to help this dude. So no, we're, we do not dislike fishing for now. Um, what is this all about? Is this a... Why is my pen? Why is my pen? <laughs> Why is my camera panning and nothing's happening? Where are we? What happened? Are you having a baby? Nancy Land Crab? Don't think I didn't recognize that ugly face. Yeah, I don't know why my camera panned just now, but we really need to go and sleep a bit because, uh, yeah, maybe let's go nap on this bench over here for a bit. I lost my train of thought, but that's okay. So let's get up our energy need a little bit in hopes of being full of energy by at least 10 a.m oh and here's the ring bear still sleeping on the little be um, bench hey wait wait whoa that was interesting just now i could have sworn for a minute that i saw his tears are gone where is he here he is no no he still has tears poor fellow oh my god no 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 sweetie i need you to nap a little bit more can you do that for me please hey wait we can build on this lot wait i'm gonna be a little bit sneaky we have a bed let's use this bed and sleep in this bed until our needs are looking great can i get some food here though it'll be fantastical but i don't see anyone there hey don't catch the ring. I Please, I'm pretty sure other sims can't. But, you know, just for the game's sake and the storytelling's sake. Don't catch the ring, you beautiful elderly lady. What's your name? Arlene Davenport. I know that name. Where's she from? Alright, I think we slept enough. Let's see if there's someone here to help um hire staff i don't have the money to hire people so we're just gonna have to wait until someone shows up do you have food oh hello oh you two are such a cute couple you dominic fires and moira fires let's grill something that's cheap maybe just grilled fruit oh we need to take a pee too it's okay we can do that soon isn't this adorable but you know what um can't you guys like give each other like privacy like these this couple was here first you know and they just came in and enjoyed the cloud gazing shenanigans googles over there i love it <laughs> it's so cute all right so you made your food beautiful now go take a pee before someone takes your food you know this is a great challenge idea you just live off of the community lots although that is something we all know by now but it's still fun hello bear i'm gonna help you my friend let's give him a pity hug and then we shall continue our fishing maybe we'll get that ring when our fishing skill goes up don't worry bear bowie is here to help you oh such a sweet thing so sad where are you going all right enjoy whatever it is you're enjoying bro oh we got a chest oh <gasps> I can't believe it! We got the ring! We got the freaking ring! There we go! Bear, where are you? I saw him leave and I hope he didn't go far, but where are you now? Ring? Here he is! Let's examine the ring. Oh my gosh. There is some old markings inside. It's some form of gnomish. Gnomish? Oh my gosh, we have gnomish language? But we can't read it. Maybe the sad looking ring bear near the fountain. Yeah, wada wada. Where are you? Come here. Ask about ring. I suppose that's what we should do. Hey, bro. Stand still. We want to talk to you. Is that the ring? Ha, huh, you found it. Nice job. Yeah, that ring has some kind of special romantic magic about it. You can't read it, you say? There are a few who can. Let me see here. It says something about a fountain. Weird. I don't know. You better not listen to me. I'm just a bear. What? Are you gonna take the ring now? 
It's yours. Let's push for questions over here. Like, let's interrogate this mother fluffer. Give me answers. I once was a sim like you. Used to think love was the meaning of life. It is not. It is a vicious cesspool of rejection that will turn your heart into a bag of shattered glass. I tried to use the ring's magic or whatever to fix everything, but it just backfired. Now, I'm cursed to live my remaining years as a bear. Just be careful. You know, thank you for the advice, but don't you want your f ring back dude that's what you wanted you wanted the ring so is the ring mine now can i propose to someone with this ring imagine you can't wait the next step is finding a fountain of some kind oh so it should be this fountain i'm, I'm sure what should we do search fountain from for clues okay search the fountain for clues oh i'm enjoying this so much all right what are you finding bobo tell me you found something yeah. bowie is barely able to make out the odd markings at the bottom of the fountain that looks like the markings from the inside of the ring interesting maybe she should go talk to the ring bear about all this dude ask about the markings on the fountain you found some more odd markings Kings. Jeez. What were those gnomes up to? Oh wait, there are something about a wall of some kind. I can't bear to think any more about it than that. I hope that helps. It probably doesn't. Of course it helps, you freaking idiot. Stop being so gosh negative. Alright, we're looking for a wall and I'm pretty sure I know what wall they're talking about. Alright, it's the wall in the trailer. I swear that that wall you see. Alright, so look closely over here, okay? This market store. Okay, wait, here's a fountain. Where is this? This area. This area is in the suburbanish place right now. That's the wall. This wall. This wall right over here. No, that's the wall I'm talking about. But is, is it in this area? Well, you know, let's maybe get her to sleep for now. All right. And while she's sleeping, we can search for the wall. Okay, so it must be in this area then. The fountain, this area over here. Where is that wall? There! Where's the freaking wall? You just insist on answers there. Listen, buddy, I can't find the wall. What wall are you talking about? Where is this wall, at least? Oh, alright, so you're just talking about yourself now. How freaking selfish we're trying to find a wall. I can't believe I'm not seeing that wall that was in the trailer. This is just so messed up. Is it hidden away behind bushes? I don't think so, because in the trailer it was open and clear enough to see, you know? But I also saw this scene in the trailer, close to that wall scene, right? So could it actually be here, somewhere? I know we're doing this all at night in our sim, you know, gotta take care of our needs and everything. You know, this is pissing me off. Where is that freaking wall? You know, it's either here, and I'm just blind, or it's not here, and I'm not blind. I think I'm looking in the wrong place. Oh my gosh, I, I just wish these houses were, you know, functional. Like, just look how beautiful the placement of these houses here are. Like, oh my gosh. Yo, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to go on with this quest without finding that wall. And I think I might need your, you guys' help on that, you know, help me find that wall. Do you know where it is? Have you seen it before? You know what, screw that. I'm not gonna stop looking now. I'm not gonna stop. Alrighty. I found it. It's over here. Now, here is the starter home. I can't believe how I mislooked this over here, but okay. Just right from the starter home is over there. And why do we have a skating rink all of a sudden? That, that's awesome. Okay. But anyway, here is the freaking wall. Let's look for clues on the wall. I knew it was this wall. I freaking knew it. Alright, so let's go there. Yeah, okay, here's the bear. Interesting. I was hoping you'd be here. Ah, and there is a scene from the trailer, you know those colorful buildings. Bowie looks over the decorative wall, depicting a young romantic couple. This must be what the ring bear was talking about, yeah. Hmm. And this is what I spent almost my whole day searching for now. But anyway, there are some markings near the bottom. Bowie looks closer, of course. Bowie has learned that the ring can be activated by rubbing it. Should she try it? Of course we shall try- Whoa, this is worth 5,000. But of course we shall attempt to rub the ring. Let's rub it. Okay. Oh. Okay. Pause. 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 All right. You're still asleep. Whoa. Bowie rubs the ring and, and begins to feel tingly all over, but in a good way. Is this what turning into a bear feels like? No. Bowie is feeling confident now, like she can magically romance some Sims. Now that the quest is complete, Bowie has unlocked the magical ring that can be put on via the dresser in Create a Sims. <gasps> You can use that ring to your power. And we're shining. That's annoying. Hey, is it really gonna stay a sad little bear forever? <gasps> oh my- Oh my gosh! I'm glad you figured out my ring! I guess I started dressing as a bear after my fiancé gave my ring back. Or maybe the ring was cursed? Who knows? All I know is when I was a kid, my mom used to dress as a bear with me. It was a bit of a phase I went through, I guess. I missed her. Aww. 
I can stop being a bear now. You can be a normal human being. Oh my gosh. Now we can now we can meet, you know, them in normal ways. We can talk about different things with him now, Sammy. Oh my gosh. I was right about him changing out of the bear costume. I thought it wouldn't happen, but it did. Yeah, you're definitely going to be our friend though, Sammy Garcia. Oh my gosh. It's, okay, it's going to be sad not seeing the ring bear anymore. But you know, we got him out of his sadness. We got him out of his misery. Oh my gosh. I wish the quest was longer than that. But you know, it was fun nonetheless. But we saved him, I suppose from being a bear forever and we're still shining like a diamond but anyway you guys i hope you enjoyed this episode i'm so sorry if this episode was maybe a little bit shorter than the others but yeah let me know what you would like to see in the next part um shall we get to know sammy garcia over here a little bit better i think we should i mean we helped him bowie bowie Stop being a bitch. But yeah, let me know what you guys would like to see in the next part. Maybe upgrade our house, make some money, upgrade our house or whatever. Oh my god, he's still sad. Are you freaking kidding me? But anyway, thank you so much for watching. I will see you all in the next one. <laughs>